Here's what happened around the world in August 2024. After banning its young progressive main opposition leader from politics for 10 years, Thailand got its youngest woman prime minister whose father and aunt were both former prime ministers. Far-right riots erupted across the UK after three girls were killed in a stabbing attack that was falsely blamed on a Muslim migrant. The Olympics ended bringing heartwarming moments like Algerian boxer Iman Khalif and Taiwanese boxer Lin Yu Ting both rising above hateful attacks about their gender and winning gold medals. This Cameroonian boxer making history as the first refugee athlete to ever win an Olympic medal. But there were still some controversies such as banners and signs showing Taiwan being confiscated and this Afghan refugee breakdancer being disqualified because she wore a free Afghan woman cape. And now the Paralympics have begun and this Afghan woman taekwondo athlete has also made history as the first ever refugee to ever win a medal at the Paralympics. Meanwhile, hundreds of schoolgirls and women in South Korea are having their photos edited into deep fake pornography and shared into telegram chat rooms with thousands of male users. Hundreds of thousands of Indonesians blocked the parliament's attempt to erode democracy and allow outgoing president Joko Widodo to establish political dynasty by sharing this blue picture to draw attention to the issue and holding mass protests. Bangladesh students holding mass protests also forced the Prime Minister to resign over a controversial law to limit government job opportunities. In India, this woman trainee doctor was raped and murdered and people demanded justice. This Iranian woman was shot and paralysed by the police for allegedly violating Iran's mandatory hijab law. The Taliban has now banned women from showing their faces or speaking aloud in public in Afghanistan. Hong Kong found these two pro-democracy journalists guilty of sedition or rebelling against the government in another attack on press freedom. Macklemore cancelled his concert in Dubai because of the UAE's involvement in Sudan's civil war. Meanwhile, cable group Entity's Tail has quit the boy band after he was accused of being involved in a sex crime case. And BTS's Sugar is facing prison or a fine for drunk driving an electric scooter. And finally, a marketing student has made history as the first deaf woman to be crowned Miss South Africa. Follow for more stories from around the world.